In this tutorial on how to use the sound click box to increase your track plays using bulk created accounts. You'll find this functionality under the menu icon here. As you can see, I have a few accounts already created, imported into the program. It has been rumored that sound click plays that happen via a logged in account count more towards your chart position than a play from a non logged in user. So for this, you will firstly need to either add in accounts or bulk create accounts using the software. You can find the create account functionality under the menu icon here. There are three ways to bulk create accounts using a single Gmail account, using a catch-all email address or importing a list of email accounts to use. If you import the account, you'll be using one email account to create one SoundClick account. The other two methods, you can bulk create accounts using a single account. For more information on this, you can click the more info and warning button. Or you can also find information on the account creation types on the forum, rootjazz.com slash forum. The controls are pretty self-explanatory. The number of accounts you would like to create, how many threads will be used to create accounts concurrently. If you'd like to pause after each account, specify a folder containing avatars that will be used at random to be applied to each account and an account bio to give to your created accounts and the proxies to use. So once you have created your accounts, you will simply need to specify the track you would like to increase. You will find it from the full info track page. So here's just a track at random I've selected. I have no idea who they are or no relation to them. So I hope they don't mind me increasing their track. Once you have the URL, you specify it here. If you'd like to add a list of referrers, which will be added to the header referrer property when the request is made, you can enter here or you can leave it blank. It doesn't really matter. The rest of the controls are similar to the account plays where you can specify the type of play um, increased to all types, number of threads and whether you'd like to repeat and the max number. So just specify 10. You can specify all accounts. As you can see, some accounts here don't have proxies, some do. If you'd like to change that, you would simply enter the account proxy here. If you know it as such, GD8080. Then once you have the account you'd like to use, simply click play and the process is added to the processor. I already have some processes running here, so when these complete, then this process will start running. When it runs, the program will log in to each account using the details. This is username, password, and the proxy. It will then navigate to the track page where it will play the song. If the song is available for download, and it does have to be available for download, you can then also use the download functionality to use logged in accounts to download your track. So you've got a play and a download. That's all there is to it. If you have any more questions regarding this functionality or any other functionality or any of our, any other of our programs, please come to the forum at rootjazz.com forum. Thank you very much.